What's up, people? Moi guys, like Kuru this video here, I'm deleting my YouTube channel at 50k subscribers. And today with my Skellington car, I've decided to share with you guys a special moment and a special training pack. So as we all know, custom trainings were added to the last update of Rocket League. Now if we go to the Creator tab, you can see what I have created for you guys. I have called it the Uru Multi-Training Bouncy. This is an all-star striker training thingy, whatever you want to categorize it as, I don't really know. So this has 10 shots. I guess the main target of practice here is dribbling. But it can also be used for like aerials, air dribbles, it can even be used for simple shots. That is why I have named it the multi-training, because I feel like you can do a lot of things in this. I'm pretty sure all of these shots include a bouncing ball that you either have to dribble or air dribble or shoot, anything. The ball's never really gonna like move along the ground, it's always gonna be bouncy. First of all, you can just, you can do this, that's some kind of shot dribble shot I'm not really sure what that is uh, you can just do a very simple dribble from here like okay I fuck I fuck no I mean I suck that was a dribble you can also air drag this this crap whatever you want to do really I mean you kind of have to turn around from the like do this little hook if you want to air dribble that shit look at that look at that look at that okay it goes over next shot so that was number one next we get to number two Pretty much the same thing. Here my favorite thing to do is air dribble. I mean that was a horrible placement, but you know there's a lot of like possibilities for this one. Look at this. Ah, uh, couldn't put it in, but still. Then obviously you can just normal dribble this. Whatever you wanna do, man. Whatever you wanna do. I I suck. You can do a freaking rebound off the back wall. Anything is possible here. That's the nice thing about this training practice, I think. Because there's a lot of there's a lot of training practices that only focus on like one thing, like like wall aerials and stuff, which is nice if that's what you want to practice. But this I feel like this can be used for so many things that you can like use it as your standard practice mode. Not really. I mean, it, it, there's certain things this doesn't really practice, which you know, defense obviously. There's this is obviously an offense thing, but still, you see this one. This is nice to air dribble, I fucking love this one. Um, you know, basic dribble works as well. I guess you could also try to do a shot like this. Oh, okay, that was horrible. That was number four, let's go to number five, shot number five. Um, inter interesting thing about this is, if you look at the timer, uh, it, it starts at one. So you really have no ch like moment to let this ball touch the ground. Like if you if it drops it's over. So you have to do something. And my favorite thing to do is try to drag it in. Like that. I don't yeah, that just didn't go in. Uh, obviously you can catch the ball off the ground, do a dribble. Anything is possible, as I've said many times in this video. Or you can do this. I guess you can also shoot it if you so desire. Oop, okay, that's a shot. I thought it's gonna hit the ground, of course. Let's go to number five, number six. <laughs> uh, this one comes straight at you. You can shoot it, dribble it, fucking again. Anything is possible. I really don't want to keep like <laughs> repeating that this whole video, but that is really the slogan of this map. Air dribbles, man. That's uh, you know, I started designing this as dribbles only, like ground dribbles. But then I figured, you know, why not make it like compatible for a lot of things because that's more fun you know I personally found it the most fun if I just do like air dribbles that seemed to be the most enjoyable thing to do with this practice and I feel like it works pretty well so if, if you're looking for air dribble practice this is definitely something that you could use uh, another thing you can do is hit it off to the back wall follow it up like so okay I don't okay never mind like so Put that shit, okay. Like so, okay. Like so, like this. Please, come on. Yeah, boy. <laughs> there we go. How many tries was that? Like, at least 10. This is awesome. I don't know. I didn't, honestly, I didn't spend a huge amount of time making this, but I feel like 
that's the great thing about this custom training thing is like you can make really nice shots and practice set like sequences with very little time with very very little time it's not that big of a an ordeal this I like to shoot I don't know really what to do with this you can air dribble you can you can experiment th with this one this is probably my least favorite shot in this I mean I guess a long like long distance dribble is what this should be uh, the last shot is actually this is the most interesting I feel like it's more about aerially so you push it back you try to like hit it in okay I fucked it up but still this is the idea of it you can all this is kind of air dribbling as well <clears throat> there's a lot of air dribbling in this if you don't want to air dribble it or aerial at all you can just catch it off the freaking ground and push that shit in but I love doing this though go yeah boy and that was it that was my 10 shots I wonder is it actually possible to do more than 10 shots in this so this is the training the like editing part of this whole thing let's see how many shots you can do holy fucking shit dude what 50 is the maximum oh my god dudes one day I'm gonna do like a link challenge which is gonna be 50 shots you have to 100% it and you get like a some kind of crazy prize that would be sick wouldn't it I feel like that would be super awesome. Like, you have to record yourself 100%ing it. That would be sick, dude. I feel like if Psyonix keeps, like, developing this further, because they said this is basically just an alpha version of the of the custom training. They have said that they want to do more with it, I'm pretty sure. So, like, I don't know. I feel like there's a lot of potential with this. They can add a rating system, which allows you to rank these custom trainings. If someone has made a sick-ass level, it'll probably be ranked at the top somewhere in the list would be cool if you could add obstacles like maybe a big ass box in the middle of the field that you have to get around somehow i actually have not even released this yet so i need to publish this right now so you guys can use it and you can use the code so publish are you sure you want to publish this sequence publish boom it's done, boys. The download code is 0608055E3E0D948. I wonder, I don't actually know how this works on PS4, but on PC, you simply, you can just click this code, copy the clipboard, and you can share your codes, like, very easily. You can just copy-paste it everywhere you want. I'm also gonna put this in the description so you can easily just, like, highlight it, copy it, and fucking go into Rocket League. And when you go to the enter code here at the bottom, you just press this button, and it'll paste whatever code have saved. I'm pretty sure this is my level, so it'll just bring you here. You know, give it a favorite if you want to have it in this favorites tab and easily access it whenever you want to. Thank you for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoy my custom training. Let me know in the comments what you thought of it. Was it helpful? Do you think it's too difficult? It is meant for sort of high level players, although I guess dribbling kind of works for lower level players too. But if you want to do air dribbles, that's probably going to be difficult for a lot of people. I am Linkuru. See you and peace. Twitter, Twitch, like, subscribe, bitch.